to be allowed to come into a franchise like, like this to see the big, massive score they've got the camaraderie it was brilliant and then sort of a one-on-one -on -one kicking session with, with Josh was, was pretty cool and the other punters as well and we saw weren't quite sure what would happen but you arrive get your boots on and suddenly you're in the team huddle you're doing high fives with the special team <laughs> it was pretty quick that before you were accepted within that squad yeah it was not like when I rocked up here I think security wouldn't be allowed near the place and, but they were really welcoming they're all good guys and I think that's just the nature of sport. Every sport's the same. Like you get into a big group, it's a bit of banter and fellas are fellas, you know. So they were really good. Um, felt a little bit strange standing there, but listening to the head coach giving a speech for Sunday was, was, was pretty cool. But uh, put the ball in the head coach got hey, Pleasure to meet you. From Ireland. Yeah, oh, it's great. We're from Ireland just this morning. Josh, Josh, and Oh, that's great. No, 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 no. no. That's awesome, man. It's a pleasure to have you out here. Oh, thank you, thank you. I tell you what, it's impressive to see uh, the similarities between he and I are there, and uh, you can tell he has a lot of power. And I've always wondered, and people always ask the question, if you got a rugby player or uh, a uh, soccer player, if they could do that and do what we do. And I think they could with enough training. And I just hope uh, our scouts weren't watching too much because it was, uh, it was pretty impressive. Would you ever fancy a go at rugby yourself? No, because I'm a big wimp. And whenever I have to go in to tackle people, I'm getting scared. And they tackle people every play. So I grew up uh, playing other sports that it did not involve tackle football. So that's why I uh, became a kicker. He's a special team, so all he has to worry about is the kick. Whereas, obviously, for us, we've all aspects of, of rugby to worry about. And, and for me, I think the pressure and the kick, I mean, to have the chance to win a game would be, would be class. But I think it might get a little bit boring for the rest of the sort of 70, 80 minutes. So, I mean, his, his ball strike was pretty pretty impressive um, and he's obviously got a really good rating um, but I think I'll just leave it to him and stick with the rugby and, and we saw you guys chatting um, you know obviously a little bit about technique and things it, it, it is different obviously kicking American football as opposed to rugby ball. it is yeah and I think a lot of it comes down to the speed they have to get the ball away after the snap and the kicks um, and so he's a lot straighter than I was without going into boring stuff I think especially since he's kicking off the ground whereas we're off a tee we were just, real, just realising that I have to sort of Changed to more his way, and I was hitting the ball a bit nicer then. But no, it was, it was really good experience, and it was quite interesting. The in NFL hall, ball flies man. a lot further, um, so it's pretty good for you when you see the ball sailing over from 50 yards. And the, what's the head coach uh, watching you kick for a while there? You, you never know, maybe just stay by your phone the next few days. Well, you never know if he comes down injured before Sunday, but uh, listen, they were a really good bunch of fellas, um, really welcoming, and I just hope they go well on Sunday.